What's going on, people? Welcome to a brand new video on the channel. Welcome to some Horizon 5 again. In today's video, I get to try your tunes again. This is fun. I love doing this. Every single time one of these videos comes out where I get to try your tunes, there's always something interesting that you guys have sent me. So in today's video, as usual, like I said, I get to try a couple of your tunes. If you want to send over some tunes, by the way, go on the Discord uh, down in the description box below. It's there. Go send tunes over, and I may try them in a future video. Now, for today, I have something kind of interesting. One of them I really, really want to try, just because I know how good this car actually is. I've done it, or I've used it in previous games before as well. Uh, so this is the car that this guy sent me. It's a 959, a Porsche 959. I've used this car before. I know how fast it actually is once you get it fully built up. Um, and this guy built it for drag racing. So I already have one here. Again, it's got 1,400 horsepower. 1,800 newton meters of torque uh, it's built for off-road racing i think mine that i have here um but this guy that built his is for drag racing and like i said i know i know how stupidly fast this guy actually is I had the same thing in horizon 4 as well and it was an absolute monster to drive so this guy like i said built it for drag racing so let's have a look and see what his setup is like and uh, uh. Oh god, that one not made my eyes water. Um, there's a share code one three three zero one three two three three. Very easy to to remember. Um, if you want to try it yourselves as well, but there it is, right there. S two nine seventeen all wheel drive drag tire compound riding suspension. Um, top speed is higher than mine. Uh, it's obviously zero to sixty is gonna be a lot higher since it's using some better tires. Weight is down slightly. Uh, grip around corners obviously that's not gonna change. Power and torque is the same as well because it uses the nine eighteen engine in it as an engine swap so um this should be fun this should be really really fun to drive all right here we are i'm ready to send this thing uh i don't know what the driver tires are set to probably unbeatable i don't think i've changed them at all since the last time launch is questionable oh my god that super is gone oh my god <laughs> 13.3 that super ran away is it a 12.7 <laughs> the driver tire absolutely dropped me um okay the launch is pretty extreme with this thing i mean it does have a lot of power yes these guys are unbeatable let's change manual with clutch let's see if i can get this thing to change here a little bit quicker as well do i short shift or do i let it rev out first until it stops slipping Oh, much better. That super is still gone. Holy. My gear changes over on point this time around. And I absolutely flew up. Should be much, much quicker. Oh, that's so close to the 12s. That is so close to the 12s. I don't know if this is a thing with this car. I don't know if, if you're... I don't know. I don't like the launch. I don't like to launch. I've built cars like this. I've shown you guys about building cars like this before as well. Where is it? There it is. I think this also has too many gears. It should be a 4-speed instead of a 5-speed. Um, First gear just hits it. Oh, I got it in the 12 nines though. Jesus. Okay. It's very, very fast. It's really, really fast. It, the launch ruins it though. The launch just straight up ruins it. So what would I change on this thing? Four speed instead of a five speed. So you, you change gears less. It already has a ridiculous amount of torque. So it doesn't really make much sense for you to have five gears. Um, and uh, yeah, that first gear is just way too short. I tried to like short shift it the second. Just to see if I can get that time down as much as I possibly can. I'm catching a super at the very end though, but it's, it's it just runs away at the very beginning, so there's like no chance. Twelve nine eight seven. Is that the same as I got the last time? I don't know, but yeah, it's 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 a fast car, right? It's very fast, but I honestly do think that you could get this thing to be even faster. I really do think you can get this thing to be even faster. Different gear ratios and everything. I definitely do think you can get this thing to be faster. I'll give it a like though, because it's, it's a fast it's a fast tune. Right, well, I have another tune ready to go. I really, really want to try this. I want to see what it's like. So, obviously, with the rise in the 
Uh, no God! Yeah, yeah, it's it's for this thing, by the way. If for, with the rise in racing up and down the hill in this game, somebody apparently has made a BMW Z hill climb tune. So the bubble car, literally this thing, and he turned it into a hill climb tune. Apparently, um, it's a naughty and punishing beast. That's a weird way to describe your mother. <laughs> Be gentle with the brakes. I'm serious. Otherwise, you will spin. That is the description for this tune that this person has sent me. Um, let's try it out and let's see what it's actually capable of. I'm kind of excited at the same time. I feel like this isn't going to go too well, but we'll, we'll try it anyway. 112-669-823. That is the share code. There is the hello climb. Hello little climb. Hello climb. I can't speak, but then again, that's not an actual word. 425 horsepower, 645 newton meters of torque, and the car weighs 534 kilos. It's a slick tire compound, it's all wheel drive. Obviously, uh, oh, it's the top of S1 as well. Right, uh, <laughs> this is gonna be a mess. 100% mess. Alright, this is, this is it here. Right, so I have the hill climb, um, event lab ready to go if I go to my events I'm pretty sure I go to my history I think I should yeah there it is right there no AI okay I don't know how this is gonna go I feel like it's not gonna go great I feel like it's not gonna go great super crazy short wheelbase of course the two rear wheels are so close together it it's practically a three-wheeler even though it's not but just the way that it's set up is just it's just bad I'm also going back to just normal manual. I don't want to have to worry about changing gears with this thing. I have many things to worry about. And changing gears that I wanted to be one of them. Alright, let's go for it. Okay, he said be gentle on the brakes. Otherwise I'll spin. Oh, oh, oh. It was, it has so much power. At first, I thought it was just wheel spin, but oh my god! Okay, that's the first tap. This is so awkward to drive. Oh my god! Well, there it goes. <laughs> I'll show you guys a third-person perspective of this thing as well in a sec, but I, I kind of need to get used to it first. It sounds amazing. Oh, it's gone. Oh, it's back. It's so all over the place. Listen. It's so all over the place. Okay. Understeer. Oversteer. All sorts. All sites. All types of steer. This thing is boggling my mind right now, by the way. I'm trying to accelerate out of the corners, but at the same time, I can't just floor it because. I just understand this so much. It's like there. Why are you going sideways, car? I'm not even giving it like that much power. I know I'm off the track a little bit as well. Well, off the road, but oh my god, I almost tipped it over. Oh! <laughs> All right, it's fun. Oh my god. It's so awkward to drive. It like turns it so tightly though. Like I just don't expect it. That's why I'm on the grass a lot of the time because it, it starts to like turn in and then it just darts into the corner really really quickly. Which means I can go a little bit faster from some of the corners but... I just don't trust- oh god, don't- don't- that's how it is. I just don't trust it. See what I mean? Like, dead. Oh, okay, brilliant. Tiniest bit of counter steer and acceleration. Did you make this- it's kind of like- it kind of feels a little bit like it's front biased. Like, very front biased. In terms of, like, power going to the front wheels. See, like, right there, the massive amount of understeer that I get with it. It's crazy. It just feels like it's it's more front wheel drive than it is all wheel drive. Did 
It's like the back end is super, super light. So that's why I said be careful on the brakes or you'll spin. See? Just like that. Because as soon as you start to... Uh, to unload the rear suspension, basically lifting the car up on the back with the... You know, when you're braking and the car tilts forward. The back just doesn't have any sort of... Pressure on those tires. No weight on them, so... It ends up spinning out. What a handful to drive. What a handful. I want to go again though. I want to do one more lap or one more run. I'm going to try and take it seriously. It did a 3.30. I want to take it seriously though. This is crazy. I can't even like position it in like a, a good like racing line or anything like that because it's just all over the place. As soon as they start accelerating, the front end just straightens out and it just goes in the direction that it wants. Super, super awkward car to drive. There we go. That's how you straighten up a front wheel drive. You just floor it. And I floor it now. <laughs> that feels so funny to drive. I'm definitely a lot more comfortable driving it now. That I know it feels like a front wheel drive a little bit more. Uh, you can see in my driving, I'm a little bit more confident with the way I'm sending it into corners and how much grip it has and everything. Like it just, it just feels so much, so much better now that I'm used to it. Okay, that's don't don't worry about that one. I meant to do that. <laughs> I do gentle acceleration, perfectly fine. I floor it, it straightens up. Instantly. You only drive this thing in 5th and 6th. There's no point of even going down at the lower gears. That's where all of the power is. That's where the control of our power is, anyway. Anything less than that, it's just... Oh, God. Anything less than that, it's just wheel spin. Almost spun out there, by the way. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Gentle now, gentle. And now floor it. Slide up the brakes. Turn it nice and tight. Down at the fifth. Oh, it's going sideways. It's okay, just floor it. <laughs> that is brilliant. What a crazy, crazy car. Oh god, I- oh my god. I lifted off the- Jesus. I went to the power, I lifted off the power, and the front end just darted into the corner so quickly. Jesus. Did not expect that. There you go. Significantly faster than before. Like, 15 seconds faster. Oh my god. What a mess to drive this thing fast. It's just crazy. It goes sideways, you floor it, and it straightens up again. It's- it's just a mess. I love it though.
Wow, what a beautiful machine that was. All right, everyone, that's it for today's video. Thank you for watching. There is so many tunes on the Discord for me to try still, so I know that people are putting them in over and over again for me to try them, and I will eventually probably get to your tune, but I, I swear, like, it's so difficult. There is hundreds of different tunes that I know for a fact I still have not even tried yet. It's like every day there is, like, six seven tunes that are being posted every single day if not even more and especially when i finish one of these videos like there's just an influx of them coming in so there's so many of these tunes that are being posted on the discord so i'm sorry if i don't get to all of them but that's it thank you for watching everyone hopefully you enjoyed today's video i'll see you guys in the next one goodbye everyone